Welcome to another episode of Data Strategy Unravel. I'm your host, Kendra Reed, Principal Data Strategy Tech Specialist at AWS. Now in part one and part two of customer experience and data strategy, we've been speaking with Dwayne and Hara, some thought leaders in this space on what exactly customer experience is, how that fits into a data strategy, um, the differences between a customer data platform and master data management platform, and where exactly a customer 360 fits into this. And now we're gonna pick up the conversation in part three, where we start to talk about the AWS services that are offered that can help improve a customer experience, as well as we're gonna wrap up the conversation, talk a little bit about some eBooks that our thought leaders have developed that can help organizations that are on this journey to improve their overall customer experience. Let's get into it. And so, you know, what you mentioned there, or and Dwayne, especially around consolidating, you know, that person and understanding that this is just one person and not three. You know, many would say that Amazon is is known for great customer experience, you know, making those recommendations, understanding what their buying habits are, you know, strategically placing products in warehouses so they can get to them quicker because they anticipate them buying that. Yeah. But then on the other hand, you know, many would say AWS doesn't have many services that is in, you know, the customer experience space, right? So how how would you two answer that question there? You want me to take it, Tara? No, oh, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> Um, so, I mean, so, so yes, there's some truth to that, right? Um, you know, so you've got Amazon Connect, Amazon Pinpoint, you've got Amazon Personalize. Those are our consumer facing services. Okay. Um, and you're right. Uh, I think what many people don't realize though, is that some of the, you know, best in the industry. Um, some of the best, you know, ISVs, so internet software vendors, they've got, you know, better connections into AWS services. So it's, you know, in, in you know, it's, and in some sense, from a technology perspective, you know, those things are better connected to the services that we've got. So that's one end, that's one end. One end. Um, the other end is around expertise, right? So many people don't realize that, you know, you've got teams like data strategy, like digital innovation, um, you know, enterprise strategy, where you've got um, we, we we lay our experiences and Amazonia techniques to help our our partners. So and and uh, and a big part of that is us taking a lot of the techniques that we use in our own products, right? So you know, working backwards, our experience design, our approach to combining qualitative and quantitative data and feeding it into experience design. You know, we relay that, we offer that back. We help our customers with those methodologies. Um, so yes, in theory, right, you know, we not have like direct services, you know, um, but you know, a large part of the ecosystem does, you know, so does work with us. And the, you know, when we talk about best practice, because customer experience isn't just about technology, right? Yeah. Um, it's about mechanisms, it's about organization, it's about culture. Um, we've got a, a strong, uh, uh, position in that space as well. Got it. Got it. Yeah, that, that makes sense, right? Especially when we talk about mm -hmm. data strategy, it's not just about technology, it's about, you know, all these other pieces mm -hmm. that kind of make up the overall mm -hmm. strategy. Um, mm -hmm. So we're almost at time here, and I definitely, you know, thank you both for taking the time to, you know, speak with us about, you know, customer experience and how that fits into the data strategy. Um, I know that you two have, have two ebooks out there, Innovating with Data, um, and then the omni-channel experience when it comes to the customer experience spaces. You know, do you want to kind of talk a little bit about that, what those both touch on before we wrap up here? Yeah, sure. I mean, and, and you know, how to you know, jump in, right? Um, so, so innovating with data is very much around um, talking about what we do every day in data strategy, right? You know, we help customers to, you know, solve, you know, you know their deepest challenges, more pressing challenges. Mm -hmm. And we use our working bathroom, working bathroom methodology to do so, right? Um, and there's a practice around that, around people processing technology, right? That we articulate in that ebook. Um, omnichannel uh, customer experiences builds on that, right? So it's saying actually there's some little extra steps that you need to take when you're talking about delivering good customer experience. There are extensions of the innovation with data story. Um, you know, you know, and there's some of that in technology. A lot of it is in techniques. A lot of that is in you know mechanisms. A lot of that is in organizing organizing something in a different way. Yeah. So yeah, we get into that. 
Thanks. Thanks. Thanks so much, you guys, for 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 taking the time. Um, for our viewers, if you want to check out both of those books, check the description below. And we'll be back soon with another episode of Data Strategy Unravel. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks.